Well, you know, sometimes we cannot help but feel the weight of life's burdens. This is Pastor Hayton and the Lord Light's devotional, and I'm here to tell you today that uh, probably uh, you're not always feeling like uh, shouting for joy. You're probably not always having a big ear-to-ear -ear grin on your face. You probably don't have that jovial laugh uh, all the time. Uh, you know, we carry some heavy burdens, don't we? And I'm so glad that uh, when we carry the heavy burdens that we know what to do with those burdens. The Bible tells us that we ought to cast our burden upon the Lord, knowing that He will sustain us. And in another place, casting all your care upon Him, for He cares for you. So we need to know just how to handle life's burdens because we are going to have them. Uh, they're going to come our way. And we might just as well be prepared for the burdens of life. I was reading in Psalm just a few minutes ago in the 67th chapter where it says, Trust in him at all times, ye people. Pour out your heart before him. God is a refuge for us. And so I'm so thankful that, uh, you know, when we are amidst all the burdens of life, uh, feel the weight of the world upon our shoulders perhaps, or going through a long, dark valley. Uh, maybe, you know, we're in a position where we just wonder if things will ever be okay. And yet I'm so glad to know what to do in times like that. Now, I know I've felt a heaviness today because of some of the things that some of my beloved church members are going through. Uh, you know, bear you one another's burdens, and if you really uh, value your relationship with brothers and sisters in Christ, uh, you're going to bear their burden the best that you can. And uh, you can't always alleviate the burden, but uh, we can feel the weight of their burden upon us. And I think about in our congregation, people that are suffering, people that are hurting, people that are going through very difficult times at this time. And my desire is to somehow encourage people to know just how to trust in Him at all times. Uh, knowing that he will be our refuge, that he will help us in the midst of all of life's problems and uh, in the times that we're carrying the heavy burdens of life. So I do think about, you know, the things that have brought a burden upon my heart today. I hate to see my beloved church people going through tough times. We've got a couple that are right now going through chemo treatment and another that's going for a, a procedure uh, this coming week, or this for coming Friday, to uh, uh, see if they can detect just what's wrong and perhaps a strong possibility of cancer. And of course, we get on Facebook and we read about uh, all the problems and things that our Facebook friends are going through as well. And so I don't think that it's wrong if we don't feel a light spirit. I don't think it's wrong if we don't have that big smile on our face. I don't think it's wrong if we feel the weight of other people's burdens. Let's just take those burdens to the Lord, knowing that He is our refuge, and we can take Him, and knowing that He will sustain us and help us in the midst of all our life's problems. Well, this has been a little scattered tonight because I, I do feel the heaviness in my heart and my concern for those that I love and those that I care about, and I do believe that... Uh, we just need to pray one for another and try to encourage one another the best we can. Let people know they're loved and, and to be there for them in any way that we can. Heavenly Father, there's a lot of people carrying heavy burdens today. Lord, may we realize that we can trust in the Lord at all times. And that means the times that we do have the heavy burden. So help us, Lord, to put our faith and our trust in God. We ask in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, I plan to see you tomorrow on Lorelei's Devotional here with Pastor Hayton. Goodbye now.